Thomas Duane Arnold, born March 6, 1959, is an American actor and comedian. He is best known for playing Arnie Thomas on Roseanne, 1989-1993, Jackie Thomas on The Jackie Thomas Show, 1992-1993, Tom Graham on Tom, 1994, and Tom Amros on The Tom Show, 1997-1998. Arnold was born Thomas Duane Arnold in Ottawa, Iowa, the son of Linda K. Nay Graham, and Jack Arnold. One, two, he had two siblings, a sister Lori and a brother Scott. As a child, Arnold was diagnosed with autism. Three, his mother abandoned the family when he was a child, and he and his siblings were raised by their father. The three were still very young when their mother, who Tom Arnold said was an alcoholic, moved out. That left them in the care of father in his early 20s, whose role as breadwinner left him little time for parenting, Arnold said. 4. In their teens, Arnold and his sister moved back in with their mother. With her mother's consent, Lori was married at age 14 to a man who was 23 years old. Soon Lori was a heavy drug user and dealer, running one of the largest meth operations in the Midwest until her arrest in 1989. 5A6. Meanwhile, Arnold apparently escaped his sister's fate and worked at a meatpacking plant. 7. He attended Ottawa High School, Indian Hills Community College, and from 1981 to 1983, the University of Iowa, where he studied business administration and writing. Tom Arnold, Rosane Burr's ex, 64, suffered a stroke while bathing his two children. To be there for them, he lost 80 pounds. Tom Arnold, an American actor and single father of two, experienced a mini-stroke while bathing his kids. He consciously made the decision to alter his life after the near-fatal incident to make sure he lives as long as possible to see his children. Arnold, now 64, receives assistance from his children, ages 10 and 7, while he recovers from his mini-stroke. In Atomogawa, Tom Arnold was born in 1959 to Jack and Linda Arnold. Yet once his parents were divorced, it was mostly his father who took care of raising him. The big bully actor, who is renowned throughout the world for his extraordinary comedic skills and abilities, began stand-up comedy in 1983 by appearing at the University of Iowa's Open McKnight. Arnold's comic career had experienced many highs and lows as he was honing his art. Even so, he placed first in the Minneapolis Comedy Competition in 1988, which inspired him to relocate to Los Angeles in order to pursue a career in stand-up comedy. Arnold's career began to soar once he relocated to Los Angeles since the same year he did, 1988. He was appointed as one of the staff writers for Roseanne Bear's popular TV program, Roseanne. When he and Bear got married in 1990, he had already begun to make appearances as a series regular, portraying the role of Arnie Thomas. The couple's marriage was obviously colorful, to put it mildly, and their sporadic outrageous conduct drew a lot of media attention. When the couple went through a very public and turbulent divorce in 1994, things began to become bad and eventually became worse. Arnold divorced Bear and then wed two more times before wedlocking Ashley Grossman, his final spouse. They have Jax and Quinn Arnold as children before separating in 2020. Arnold had recently appeared at a red carpet event and was sporting an instantly observable new physique. Two years after experiencing another health scare, the failure of a large organ, the actor revealed that he dropped a total of 80 pounds following a mini-stroke. Arnold only had two people in mind when it came to the motivation for his choice to improve his way of life, his children. Well, I significantly altered my way of living. My children, Jax and Quinn, who are 10 and 7, are present. I then came to the conclusion that I should start working out. Better go to it. What took place the day Tom Arnold experienced a mini-stroke? As previously indicated, Arnold wed Grossman and had two kids a little later in life. 
He was 54 years old when he had his firstborn son, Jax, through IVF in vitro fertilization, and he was 57 when he had his daughter, Quinn. The former married couple had the children through IVF. Arnold, who has a keen understanding of the value of slowing down and savoring special moments, is unflappable when it comes to spending time with his kids. Arnold has always been a committed and caring father to his kids, and his health scare made him realize right away that he needed to change for the better. He attributes adopting a healthy lifestyle to becoming a father, growing older, and going through substantial changes. I believe that as you age, you've experienced some things. And knock on wood, that served as a tremendous wake-up call for me. There are many benefits to getting older, like receiving social security when I reach 65 and ceasing to pay alimony the day after. One day in January 2022, there was the terrible health concern. Arnold was busy bathing his children and taking care of other fatherly responsibilities when the unexpected occurred. He described the incident's exact course in detail. You probably already know how difficult it may be to get children to enter and exit the bathtub during bath time. So I do something. I enter the restroom, open the door, count to ten, and the winner is the person who leaves first. My right eye looked like a curtain when I turned around, and I immediately reasoned that perhaps I had accidentally hit my eye while counting. He continues by saying that when he was putting the kids to bed, he experienced a partial vision restoration, which led him to believe that everything was well. Arnold made the decision to visit the eye doctor the next day rather than traveling to Alaska to record a pilot for a production to make sure everything was okay. I was about to go to Alaska the following day to film a pilot when I decided to stop by the eye doctor on the way to the airport. As it turns out, the news is not what anyone likes to hear. But when he returns, he says, you had a stroke, and I immediately thought, oh no, you've got to be kidding me, since you always wonder what that will entail. As a result, you must follow the 24-hour stroke protocol at UCLA. While still at the hospital, Arnold got a thorough examination while counting his blessings. He was overjoyed to learn that his mini-stroke registered as level 1 on a scale of 1 to 10. Arnold weighed a whopping 285 pounds until he made a conscious effort to lead a healthy lifestyle and shed 80 pounds. The singer claimed that he was aware of the physical limitations and effects that his heavy weight had on him. Particularly when he tried to be active with his kids, he would notice these difficulties, which he quickly knew would start to interfere with his capacity to be a decent father. The actor adds that staying sober was another factor in him leading a healthy lifestyle. He recently completed five years of sobriety and discussed how things might have been worse if he hadn't already been sober at the time of his health scare. It would have been much worse if I hadn't been clean and sober. I became sober years ago, which is something you have to do. It would have been worse in every way. My kids and health-related issues would have suffered more as a result. Arnold devotes all of his time to being the best single father possible now that his health concerns are behind him. As much of the narrative has previously established, Arnold's children served as the primary impetus for his quest to get healthier. A repeating definitive clause that Arnold's life has improved as a result of his need and desire to be there for his children is the bond and affection he has for them. He consistently expresses his appreciation for being a father. You really can't be selfish for me as a single father in his 60s, with a nine-year-old and a six-year-old. Did you marry too many times? People ask me because I've had four ex-wives. Very likely, but it was necessary to get here, and here is where I've always wanted to be in my life. Spending time with these kids every day is thrilling, and I'm extremely thankful for that. Arnold, who has a keen understanding of the value of slowing down and savoring special moments, is unflappable when it comes to spending time with his kids. After experiencing what he has, he is aware that tomorrow is never guaranteed. With my kids, it happens daily. 
You awaken each day with the realization that this is not limitless. Like, I'm 64, my kids are really little, so you have to strive to make every day with them the greatest one possible. Arnold would place first in a parenting competition if dad goals was the category. For him, making lasting memories with his children involves paying less attention to worldly things and more attention to the experiences. I'm incredibly lucky because of the memories and things we do together. I'm fortunate to be a dad. Being alive is a blessing. Arnold is undoubtedly one of the best fathers out there, but he can't take all the credit for it. In fact, much of what he has learned about being a single parent comes from his own father. On Father's Day, Arnold thanked his father for teaching him everything he knows today. His father had raised him and his siblings as a single parent as well. Enjoy your Father's Day. As a 22-year-old father, Jack Arnold was responsible for Scotty, 18 months, Lori, 3, and Tommy, 4 years old. Even though he died away three years ago, I continue to learn from my father on a daily basis about life and fatherhood. One of the most devoted and affectionate fathers in Hollywood is Arnold. His acting job keeps him busy when he's not too busy attending his daughter's dancing recitals or assisting his kids with their entrepreneurial creativity in the form of lemonade stands and other such endeavors. Thanks for watching my video.